Friends, how many times have you wandered into a Christmas party and thought to yourself, oh my God, there are too many beverages. How am I going to choose? I mean, there's a punch bowl, and there could be anything in that punch bowl, and there's a set of bottles along the side, and there's something in a cooler, and oh my God, I don't even remember what I drank at the last party, and everybody knows the rule. You can't drink the things in the wrong order, or you'll be sick all Christmas. Am I right? Yeah. yeah. Am I right? Right? You know, so it's beer before liquor, never sicker. Liquor before nog, otherwise you sleep like a log. Logs before punch drinks, shots before jello shots, otherwise you'd wake up with your stomach tied in knots, right? Like that's the rhyme, right? That's how that goes. Everyone knows this rhyme. Am I right? You know this rhyme, right? Yeah. Except maybe you don't remember this rhyme when you're feeling like this. <laughs> 2 a.m. at the holiday party. Oh, yeah. You see your hangover following you to work the next day? It is right on your shoulder, howling down at you saying, did you do the nog out of order? That's what's whispering. Did you put the nog too soon? That's why you need nog log. Now, my wife wanted me to call it eggnog log, but I think there's a lot of nogs out there these days, and I don't want to discriminate. So nog log it is. Now, nog log is a special new device that you can attach to the bottom of any glass that when you tip it up, allows you to see every drink you've had that evening that you've pushed onto the log just with your fingerprint. Yeah, the nog, has li the nog log has special little raised buttons, just like on the top of a soda cap, that you press them down. And when you've drunk the thing, you can look on it and be like, hey, nog, I have nogged, right? Because you don't want to get your nog out of order, no. <laughs> out of order nog causes fearful hangovers and bad decisions. <laughs> If you have nogged too early in the evening, the next thing you know, the mistletoe goes too low. <laughs> and Nog Log can help you prevent that by helping you keep track of the order of your holiday libations. Now, you might think, I don't seem like the kind of person who has a problem. I look like someone who has it all together. I look like someone who might not need to start a company that advertises for Nog Logs at 2 a.m. in San Francisco small public access markets. <laughs> Why does someone like me need to create a problem like Nog Log? Well, I once was like this. <laughs> yeah. Just pretending my life was going okay, when every day it felt like I was riding a rainbow bouncy horse. <laughs> That's how my stomach felt. That's how my body felt. I was just drinking all the wrong things at all the wrong times. And so while I desperately tried to code the coding thing that that guy from Rap It taught me to do on the internet, <laughs> I took that class and, and I was getting ahead in the world, but inside my insides were roiling and I, I didn't know how to how stay on top. I could barely ride the horse. And every time I looked at the guy riding the ball in the corner, I just got queasy. <laughs> I thought there's gotta be a better way. What am I doing wrong? So first I tried paleo and then I tried master cleanse and then I tried just drinking water and then I tried just living on air and then I tried making my own macromyotic soda bread and just living on that for two days. <laughs> None of these things worked. I was at my wit's end. How can I possibly make my life organized, together, and combined into a holistic appreciation of the world around me at the holidays? Maybe even not even just at the holidays. Because really, once you've tasted the sweet, sweet nectar of Nog, do you want to save it just for the holidays? Don't you want to be able to have Nog all year long? And don't you want to be able to know you've had some Nog? Because what if you had the Nog, and then you forgot that you had the Nog, and then the love that the nod gave to your tongue, that sweet velvety coating of custardy egg yolks and milk and nutmeg and just a little bit of alcohol. When that velvet liqueur caresses your mouth, you want to remember that feeling. But then you do a shot of Jaeger and it all goes away. <laughs> Bring the nog back with the nog log. Now, 
The Noglog is open for business right now. <laughs> in fact, if you call the number at the bottom of your screen right now, you can get not one, not two, but 18 Noglogs. <laughs> That's almost enough to get you through the entire advent calendar, because I'm assuming that some nights of the holidays you may not be drinking, because you do have to get some work in before your vacation kicks in. So 18 Noglogs should get you through all your Christmas parties. Now. The Noglog not only has those special divots that you can press down to keep track of your beverages, it also includes a special drink analysis system to let you figure out if there's any nutrition in the alcohol you've been drinking at all. <laughs> As you know, there are these fancy things out there that people drink now called liqueurs, like Fernet. You may have heard a bartender tell you that that is a secret drink that only bartenders know to order. Why is that? Why do the bartenders drink this Fernet? That is because it is made of the pericarp, endocarp, and mesocarp <laughs> of magical herbs grown in Switzerland. Yeah. Wouldn't you want to remember to drink that in the middle of your holiday festivities? Yes, you would. Because then, instead of Jaeger, you have the smooth, silky feeling of bartender comfort supporting you as you make your way through your evening drinks knowing that you have the stamina of someone like that lovely lady behind the bar right now who can keep serving you drinks all night while sipping away on that tasty, tasty mesocarp, which provides all the antioxidants you need to get you through an evening of drinking. <laughs> now, some people have said to me, Noglog, that sounds French. <laughs> and we don't do French things in America. No American is gonna wake up at two in the morning and see something called Noglog. They're gonna be like, that looks French. I'm not buying that. And I will tell you, they are not wrong. Noglog is French, but that is because it is a fabulous, retching, avoidance, new curative heuristic. <laughs> you can avoid all the retching that you were doing before you kept track of your nog with this magical heuristic that you attached to the bottom of your cup, and you just keep nubbing it away. <laughs> now, I would also like to point out that the Noglog can be a great way to meet people, because it's there on the bottom of your cup, you're keeping track of your drinks, you're feeling, you're like, I'm two down, I'm four over. That means Nog plus Nog plus bourbon, plus two shots of Jaeger, plus one salt, you know, plus one seltzer water, I'm good. I'm good for at least another two hours. You meet, you start talking to someone else, you kind of like them, you want to get to know them a little better, you let them feel the bottom of your cup. They know where you are in your evening. <laughs> you feel the bottom of their Noglog cup and you go, oh yeah. <laughs> I know what you're ready for. Your next Nog. <laughs> and then you can Nog together. Might I even call it a Snoglog? <laughs> Some people might say yes. So. This is your limited time opportunity to order Nog Logs now, to get your way through your holiday drinking, to keep track of all your Nog, and so that your holiday experience feels like you're floating underwater with someone you love saying, hey, is it A-OK -okay to drink more Nog? <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Let's go on this holiday adventure together. Let's see things we've never seen before. Let's avoid that queasy seasickness that can plague you after drinking the wrong alcohol in the wrong order. Do, are you with me? Yeah! Call 1-800-NOG-LOGS now. <laughs>